Hi, I'm Kelsey. I'm, I do marketing communication for Craft Beer Cellar, and I'm also a certified Cicerone. And uh, we were looking at pairing a beer with the honey braised pork tenderloin with uh, the butter uh, spetzel and the poached apple and um, the cider demi glace. So what stood out for me right off the bat was the, the spetzel, which is a very German style noodle. Um, and the honey braised pork is gonna have a lot of richness to it. So I went with the German Dunkel. And uh, this is a lager from Germany and it is dark in color and has a lot of good roastiness to it. Um, a little bit of sweetness, but also has a good dryness to it. So not only are we looking at an appellation with, or a sense of place where we're getting um, the German beer with kind of a German influenced food, but um, we're looking at the color here, which is a, a, a darker lager. And uh, if you go back into the history of German brewing and you look at beer that was brewed before the 1800s, it's pretty much all gonna look like this or even a little bit darker because they didn't have the technology to brew uh, pale lagers at that point. Um, but the brewery here is Eyinger, and they're just outside of Munich. They've been brewing since 1877. And um, what really works well with this pairing is you get that caramel malt, malt sweetness, you get a little bit of roast, and the nuttiness from, from the malts are really gonna stand out. and that's what gonna bring out the honey sweetness of the pork tenderloin. Um, it's the spetzel has a little bit of nuttiness to it, so it's gonna be a great pairing with that. And this beer is fairly dry, so dry on the finish. And what that's gonna help do is when you have the sweetness of the poached apples and the, that cider demi gloss, it's gonna kind of keep that in check a little bit and uh, kind of scrub your palate, make sure that the sweetness isn't overwhelming and make you ready for the next bite. I'm Kelsey Roth with Craft Beer Cellar, proud supporter of the Chef's Table Foundation.